we're gonna get into it we're just gonna jump right in and as we do so uh this is gonna be interesting so it's exactly as the title says. Enemies are gonna be invisible. HUD is invisible. Boss health bar is invisible. Lock on is invisible. We're not seeing anything this run, guys. Yeah, no, I'm, oh, oh God, oh. Okay, so as you can see, or rather, as you can't see, the enemies are invisible. Particle effects are still there. But the enemies are invisible. So the uh, the the bright side of what's going on here is that enemies in DMC3 have really really good sound tells. Um. The the downside is that I'm gonna be talking as per is the point of a stream, kind of. Ah. DTE is also gonna be huge. I can still see the particle effects of the ones that have devil triggered. I can kill the ones that aren't devil triggered first. Man, I w wouldn't it be cool if I could see my health? I mean, health is uh, health isn't health isn't real though, right? That's the thing. Just like the enemies, how can I be taking damage if there's nothing there to hit me, right? Am I locked on to the thing? Yes. Good. Hey y'all. The schizophrenia is hitting hard. I haven't taken my medication. Royal Guard might have unironically been the choice for this. I know it's like <laughs> you can't see enemy attacks. What do you what do you mean? What do you mean you're gonna Royal Guard? That no weapons run changed me. I feel like I could Royal Guard stuff that I can't even see. The best part too about boss fights is it's gonna be really fun. Cause we don't know how much health they have left. It's genuinely gonna be a, a mystery of how long the boss fight is gonna go. We also don't know how much health uh, I have. So it's gonna be a genuine mystery of like, am I close to death? I feel close to death, you know? Can he royal guard the prescribed pills? Yes. I'm very curious to see what Cerberus is gonna look like. Is it just gonna be floating ice? Okay. This, this little, this little shadow over here needs to... Mm. Okay, whatever, okay, wait, you're a teleporty boy? Okay, well, you're fine then, you get to live. You, this shadow needs to die. We're just gonna push him over to this corner right here. Wait a second. Kalina and Perch, plus health, plus ratio. They actually can't beat the, the rocket allegations. Good stuff. If I can't see them, just blow them up. Nuclear bombs. Wait, there's a non dt chat. Okay, I fear my, I fear my time on this earth is short. Yo, bro, how do you feel about that? I did it. Um, all right, what does Cerberus look like? I missed a green orb. I'll be back at full health in no time, CJ. Don't worry, we're not doing this first try. Or we are. Or we are, who knows. Okay, well, cutscene Cerberus looks fine. I will admit, I did not test Cerberus. I didn't test all the bosses. I tested some of the bosses to make sure it was working. I did not, in fact, check Cerberus. So, okay, well, that's, uh, that about, that's about right. Um, Cerberus crashed the game. Skip the cutscene. Nope, it crashes. Okay, we're skipping Cerberus. We're just gonna say, um, it's part of the mod. You guys couldn't see it?
but I beat I beat Cerberus and and we're uh, we're moving on. You know, it's there's there's a lot going on that that none of us can see right now. So <laughs> I'm not afraid because I because I can't I can't see them. Okay. Oh, yep. I just need a helm splitter, please. That's all I wanted, bro. Uh, yeah, 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 I figured. The enigmas, man. Wily bunch, I'll tell you. If that room goes right, it goes right. If it goes wrong, uh, well, you guys just saw what happens when it, uh, when it goes wrong. All right, Th you know, I think we're gonna go with um, my normal uh, strategy, which I have um, called, I have dubbed it the Lucid Enigma patented baby back bitch boy strategy, TM, uh, registered trademark of uh, Lucid Enigma Corporations. Uh, right, so you might be wondering, the heck, the, the heck is that? Well, uh, it is, it is this. That's it. That's the whole strategy. Become ceased of the D variety. Okay, deceased. Great name for the run. It came to me in a dream. Oh, okay, so, um, it wasn't the Gigapede. Oh, this run is, uh, it's, it's off to a great start. Yeah, so, uh, chat never got to see Gigapede. <laughs> and you know what? They still never will. <laughs> Ow. Okay, well that wasn't good for my health. You scared? I'm a little scared, not gonna lie. Odd pattern, but you know. Oh, he's dead. Boom. Was that first try? First try invisible gigapede? All right, well, uh, mission four done. I can't believe it. Oh my God, the balls are invisible. Good thing I know the top. Stay where the shadows are not, dude. Ah, ah! Random balls. We DT and hold royal guard. Trust. This is gonna be huge. You can block them all with ultimate. Fair, but that doesn't gain me royal guard meter. Oh, he's dead. They're invisible jester. Slain. What about the lady boss fight? We'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see it when we get there. Or rather, we won't. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Okay, so chat. This is what I like to call baby back bitch boy strategy Mach 3. Lucid, what is... Where's, where's Mach 2? Uh, haha, there is no Mach 2. It keeps the fans coming back, hoping one day they might see Mach 2. But that's the trick. There is no Mach 2. If you were a One Piece character, who would you be? And you must experience their suffering. I would be the one guy who started the entire anime. The dude that was like, that asked Gold D. Roger about the One Piece before he got executed. I would be that guy. And I would I would go around, I would oh well. That would be my 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 humble brag. I would be like, yeah, I kinda started the the like, you know, the the age of pirates and stuff. Like, you know, all the people searching for the One Piece? Yeah, that's cause I asked. I asked Gold Roger about that. How are you supposed to beat Virgil? By Inflicting damage upon him, and avoiding damage being afflicted upon my myself. Oh boy! 
This is... This is something. I cannot see. I think that's the point. But... What? Did I kill them both at the same time? Phase skip while invisible? Holy! Someone who can control us. This mod is so cool! <laughs> I love this so much. You've grown stronger. Go to hell! We're gonna fight Invisible Virgil, are you ready? Okay, so the game crashed when entering this room. Yes! Okay, we're here, chat. Y'all wanna see me parry Virgil? Boom. Boom. The swords are invisible? Wait. Wait, oh no. People ask, like, how am I gonna do X boss, Y boss? Like, how am I gonna do Virgil? I mean, I'm I'm doing Virgil like this. I don't I don't know. He's also getting desperate. He's low on health because he only starts like spam chasing you like that when he's low. How close is he? How close am I? I don't know. Got him! Whew. What am I gonna do about Arkham? Same thing I do every day, Pinky. Take over the world. Where is the blue suddenly coming from? So, the lore is... What we just did, fighting nothing, uh, that was reality. Now, this cutscene is showing what that battle looked like in Dante's head. So in reality, he was fighting nothing. But in but in his mind, this this was playing out. That's the lore. Oh. Okay. It crashed again. I guess it doesn't like the gray the gray boys either. Okay. Well, it's also not invisible. And it also crashed, right? Because it spawns those enemies in the fight. We're gonna move on to mission nine. Cerberus also crashed the game. Uh, which means we're gonna have to take an alternate boss rush route, which that should be fun since we can't do Cerberus in the boss rush. Wondering how Beowulf is gonna go. Ooh, I love me some Beowulf. He's probably one of my favorite fights. You hit that, you hit that, boom. And also, you hit that just for Cle- Oh shit. Oh boy. Yup. She do be invisible. The bats are not invisible, though, which is what she attacks with. And that's... Kind of funny. How much force Nero puts into his drop kicks? Approximately as much force as would go into a running drop kick. <sighs> People always talk about the reboot Virgil abortion with the sniper rifle. Dante just gave Nevin an abortion with ivory. No one ever talks about that. He literally shot her in the womb. Daily routine, 6 a.m. wake up. Fight Virgil. And then fight Virgil for 16 hours. Sleep for seven. <laughs> oh, I was like, wait, where'd he go? All right, come here, big boy. Come on, 
He's still a joke. The cages are invisible? Oh, this is problematic. Oh, this is very problematic. I was like, I'll just royal guard the cages, brother. Okay, hold on. Wait, that's... That's illegal. All right, we're gonna swap Kalina and for Spiral. Uh, this just got way harder. Okay. Good. Oh, there was still a cage. Ah, uh, the freaking cages, bro! Got him! Whoa! Invisible Beowulf! In the books! I was more blind than he was! <laughs> Man had one eye, I was working with zero! Foot dive, foot dive. Uh, um, it's called Killer B? Okay, uh, Doc, foot dive. Foot dive is what it's called when Dante does the move after throwing Rebellion. Okay. Talk about shadow boxing. <laughs> all right, all right. I was kind of scared about how this would be to dodge. Pretty easy. And then, check this strat chat. Check it. Crazy. It's just my normal strat. Except he's invisible now. And first try. Okay. Well. <clears throat> good. Good first attempt, though. You might be like lucid. Is that really worth it when you royal guard the the swords and you release on Virgil like that? Yes. Whatever damage I take. Is so negligible. It's crazy. Compared to what I get out of it, damage wise. I know you can't see it, but just trust me, bro. Trust me. Okay, okay, we're at Yamato phase. Okay, I've got to be low health. I've taken a lot of hits. But he's got to be pretty low too. All things considered. There we go! <sighs> How much harder would it be if I was also invisible? I don't know if it would be that much harder, per se. I think it would be less engaging for the Sorry, viewers. This is no place for a little because when you're playing the game, you know, you have a feel for what you're doing. You know the buttons you're pressing. It might be a bit disorienting to get used to, but I think generally overall, you're fine. It would be not that much different. But for the viewer on the stream, it would be like, yeah, but I mean, it's just in, it's just a blank arena. Like what, you know? I think the way it is now is like the best. Just as it does every morning, Temenigru is now becoming erect. I was, uh, I was doing some electrical work 
last night. Exactly like Amogus, yes. I was connecting the red wires and the blue wires and the yellow wires, but I'm colorblind, so they were all gray. So I was connecting the gray wire to the gray wire to the gray wire. That's how come it took me so long. Yes, that's exactly what I did. I built the DMC4 laser corridor, yeah. I also installed an elevator exactly like this. Um, I also may or may not have put in a moat that looks oddly similar to this room, as well as a hidden secret wall that will take you to a room not too dissimilar from this one. What I'm trying to say is I live in Temenigru. Man, this is really, I really, I, wow. Okay, I died very quick there. Rebellion. It's French. That's that's why it hurts demons. It's because it's it is of their own ilk. AKA French. I'm kidding. I love the French. All of my French enigmas out there. You guys are awesome. Alright. I went on a three mile walk. AKA a very long path. So if you're not sure how long three miles is, just think about, okay, well, how long is three miles? And there's your answer, three miles. Am I getting old? Yes, I am. I am 89 now. For the lore keepers, I am, I am 89 years of age now. So, that's, I'm, I'm getting up there, guys. I'm in my sunset years, for sure. That's another thing I installed last night. I, I put in giant guillotines. That's that's the name. That's what they're called. Giant guillotines into my home. So, I mean, hey, if somebody rolls up and they see those and they go, Royal Guard, you can take it, buddy. You can have my home. You've earned it. If they, if they walk through my DMC4 laser hallway trap, and then they walk through my giant guillotines and I just hear him go, Royal Guard, take it all. Here, ha have my wallet. By the way, uh, my social security number is 255555555. Um, can I get you a drink while you're here? You need anything else? Need credit card info? I, I got you, man. I think I can go downstairs though, right? Or do they spawn? Okay, they spawn down here. Okay. I don't know, oh, I see her. Rather. I saw where the missiles came from. Okay, I did one too many there. Devils. Ow. Worth it. Does Dante know what a book is? No, he can't see them. In theory, Waifu could raid me at any moment. He could raid my secret base. If, if anyone's gonna break into my home, say Royal Guard, and just walk through all of my traps unscathed, it would be waifu runs. I mean, let's be real. If Jester raises his hand, but nobody can see it, is he still gonna give you a spanking later? Oh boy, it's moon time. Huh? Right, the moon shoots explosives. I forgot. Also, you're, you're damn right though. I should add Jeeves. This is the hallway. Okay. That was the crash hallway. I remember now, fourth chair mod. Here we go, chat. Is Goku goated? No, unfortunately. <laughs> wow. Not even close. 5,012 breaks away. You predict you're wrong, AF. Grim says three more. It was actually two more. You can always play DMC IRL. Oh, true. I love jump canceling on my friends. <laughs> yeah, dude, our Royal released a car the other day. I swear that thing was coming right at me. All right. It's time for chess. 
Okay, this is him right here. Good. He's gotta be so close, guys. I've gotta be so close to death. Mmm. The desire to just DPS versus the primal urge to live. Please. I'm just a widow Dante with 4 HP. All the king's horses and all the king's men, bro. I'm about to be Humpty Dumpty. Please. This is fine. Everything about this is... Yes! Yes! Oh, the king has been conquered. Holy crap, man. It was worth it. How long did that take? It was one hour. That was an hour and five minutes? No way. There's no way. If you're familiar with the fast route here, right? The fast route is Agni and Rudra, Beowulf, and Cerberus, right? I can't do that because Cerberus crashes the game with this mod, unfortunately, right? So what we actually have to do is we have to do Beowulf, Agni and Rudra, Nevin, and Garion. This, this is Beowulf. As you cannot see, Red is freaking dead, bro. Okay. All right. Here we go. Right, I forgot. Oh! That was it! Now, unfortunately, chat, how much did you miss? Well, we're on mission 19. So, it's a proven known fact that Abyss crashed the game. This mission has Abyss enemies in spades. So rather than crash the game again, just for the sake of testing, because I know it's going to, I'm going to enable boss rush and go directly to Arkham. One, two, jump. One, two, jump. One. Okay, get away. I'll talk about dolphins, but those things look like eels. Oh, oh, they they look like eels to you right now, Pedro. Yeah. Is that is that what they look like? They look like my sleep paralysis demons right now. Like the way we would do Pokemon duels is we would find a nice cave, a nice cave wall, and we would paint the Pokemon on the wall. How did I decide which cave painting one? Um, see, that's the fun part. We didn't, because we could never agree. And since it was on the honor system, like, you know, Caveman Joe would go and tell his friends that he won. And then me, I'd go tell my friends that I won. Because there is no honor among cave trainers, is how the saying goes. Card games are like the caveman version of gotcha games. It's true. At least you own your cards forever if you take care for them. Not for gotcha games. Mmm, L plus ratio. My PNG is actually an NFT, and so I own it forever. Dante washed his hair in the first cutscene of DMC3. Mmm, doubt. Not my Dante. I used to, when I first did Gun Only, I had 17 bars of health instead of 20. Until one stream where I did a, a casual, like, DDMK style switcher run, uh, chat was like, nah, you're getting the blue orbs, bro. I was like, okay, well, what am I missing, chat? And I don't know how they knew. Because it's not like I gathered all of them on stream. Like, it was with for my save file that was... Like, I had done off-stream a lot of stuff. But Chad just knew. They were like, okay, you're you're missing the Beowulf Adjudicator in the parkour room, mission 17 or whatever. You're missing 
uh, this one up here that you have to jump into a crevasse for. Your missions, you're missing secret no secret room number 11. Like, they just knew. I don't know how they did it. Chat is a magical being of many talents. One hour and ten minutes took longer than chess. Oh boy. And that was with a mid-boss checkpoint. Go back to the Asloom, Arkham. I'll try it your way for once. Remember what we used to say? Jackpot. Here we are, chat. The moment you've all been waiting for. No way. You got your own. He wants to stop you! It's like, I can just tell. That's the thing. I fought Virgil so much. I just know. You know? It's like, it's that thing. Phase three already? No! Okay. I'm not dead. Come on. I'm not dead? Huh? Huh? I remember. Oh. It's the random one. Invisible Virgil 3, chat. Invisible Virgil 3 <laughs> on Dante Must Die difficulty. Second try! What? Second try? All that Royal Guard training for my no weapons really, really paid off. <laughs> How was Arkham longer? Nine minutes. Chess took an hour and five minutes. Arkham took an hour and ten. Virgil 3. Arguably the hardest boss in video gaming history. <laughs> On DMD, anyways. Took a mere nine minutes. Two attempts. Oh, yeah! Two euros from Raid in Heaven. That was the best fight I have never seen. GG. <laughs> <laughs> Read out the mission 20 ranks. As S. Yep. Thank you guys for hanging out. I appreciate every one of you. Thank you for the super chats. Thank you for the new members. Take care, guys.